Ooh, look at this lighting. Hey guys, it's Lauren from ShopVividRose.com and I wanted to give you guys an update of the rice water challenge. Now, you've seen it all through YouTube and everything like that. Does it work? Does it not work? Yes, it works. And according to your hair type, you might have to tweak it a little bit, but it definitely works. Um, I actually got my hair cut in September and I was so sad because I went from here to here like I literally couldn't even put my hair in a ponytail so I was just like oh my gosh like how like how am I gonna put my hair in a ponytail so scrolling through Instagram I see a video from Miss Debbie um, I will post her video in the description and basically um, follow her instructions on you know one cup organic rice one cup water let it ferment for you know 24 hours 12 hours if you can't wait the whole 24 hours now um the first time i did it i actually messed up because i used the trader joe's tea tree shampoo and then i used the texture id shampoo and then the texture id conditioner what i realized because after i did it i'm like my hair is dry like i do i don't think this is gonna work for me like my hair is dry i realized that the texture id shampoo is a clarifying shampoo so what you need to make so basically i clarified my hair then clarified it again then put the conditioner on it so it just was like out of whack now now you know if i was to clarify my hair i would clarify with one shampoo and then use a moisturizing shampoo then do the rice water then do the conditioner i have seen videos where people have done the rice water before they put on their conditioner um so i might try that as well and um i've also seen a video and i will link her video in the description below as well um i don't remember her name but she actually put hibiscus leaves in her rice water so i will definitely try that because i need anything that i can so, so my hair will not be dry so what really prompted you know me wanting to take better care of my hair was the fact that yeah my hair was long but it was extremely dry and that's one of the main reasons why you know I did protective styling because I myself could not do my natural hair it was getting to the point where you know sometimes I would do a twist out or I would you know try to do a natural style and my and my hair would just look crazy because it was damaged and it was dry and I didn't know like what I was doing wrong I was trying different products you know seeing what you know people were doing on YouTube and stuff like that and none of of those products work for my hair you know like I literally have 4c nappy hair and I was on the verge of getting a relaxer and I've been natural for you know over 10-15 years so I actually um, I found a hair salon in Atlanta so if you're in Atlanta you can check the description below hey Miss Baker hey Dania and they really um helped me as far as you know getting my hair back on track and um they specialize in natural hair um i went there first time had a consultation list of questions you know trying to figure out what my goal was and if i was allergic to anything because it's crazy that a lot of these products you never know um your stylist might be using you never know you might be allergic to so having a consultation when you first visit um, a new salon is very 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 important so in conjunction with doing the rice water i also go to the salon every six weeks so every two weeks i wash my hair and i do the rice water and then that six week i'll go to the salon and then they'll do the hydro steam treatment and everything like that i am also using this and this So these are my results. I'm very happy. I'm, I feel like my hair is like, 
you know super super healthy now if you guys see the before picture you'll see that I had like super super split ends and things like that so I can't wait to see you know the next six weeks the next six months see how long my hair is you know like I'll definitely um, keep this in my regimen and then I'm also the next time I do it I'm also going to use the hibiscus leaves so I will leave a link um, in the description below if you don't know where to find hibiscus leaves as well to stay updated make sure you subscribe to my channel and also hit that notification bell so you'll know when I release new videos and also if you have tried this leave a comment below because I definitely want to see your results as well like comment subscribe and thank you guys for watching That way you guys can see how long my hair gets because I'm trying to get, you know, I'm trying to get all the way to my booty and then honestly, I probably won't even be wearing wigs no more unless it's blonde or red or blue.